It's time to fire this thing up. Hit it. What everybody's looking at is one of my unprotected tilings that is kind of the foundation to the new Deco boat lift that we installed. Well, good deal you made it. Hi, I'm John Graviscus. This is Mark Horder from Snap Jacket, and it's great to have you guys back around the waterfront. Now, Mark, I, I have an issue. These four pilings that make up my boat lift are not sleeved at all. Could we show everybody what we have here? This, this is a nice cutaway. Guys, this is the damage that happens on a piling with worms and, and, and just shell growth. Okay, it'll, it'll, it'll hourglass it, thin it out, okay, and it's not as strong. What have you come up with to remake, if you will, an existing piling that's been damaged by organic growth? Well, we came up with the, uh, a product called Snap Jacket. It's actually a large diameter PVC pipe that is extruded with a male and female connection system. And the connection system allows you to open the pylon or the jacket and put it around the pylon and then close it and snap it back together. And once you snap it back together, it becomes watertight and very strong, which will hold concrete in it. Okay, look at how thick this is, guys. Okay, this is, this is quite thick. I have other pilings that have been wrapped, and they're wrapped with a thin kind of plastic film, and, and the marine contractor used uh, stainless steel nails about every three, four inches, and, and kind of held it tight. But, but here's the issue, is water can still kind of flow in and out. And if you look at some of my seams, you'll see oysters, you'll see shell, you'll see barnacles, and, and it's like busting out the seam. And I don't want the concrete to break down to just rocks and kind of disintegrate, it's, it's, it's going to expose this hourglassing again. And Mark, this, this is a much better mousetrap than the conventional type of treatment. A barnacle or oyster can't really bust that. I mean, I'm telling you, this thing is locked into place. What is the importance of the concrete? Why do, why do you use the jacket as well as the concrete? Well, the jacket's basically a stay in place form to hold the concrete and the concrete is adding strength back to the pylon that you lose from the wood board, and it also will kill them immediately as soon as the concrete goes in. It suffocates the oxygen and the lime in the concrete. It's like a pesticide. It, it kills them instantly. Now, the EPA has kind of changed what they inject in the pilings, right. and it's really reduced their shelf life. And if you were to go to a marine contractor and have a piling replaced, guys, it, it's going to run you anywhere between $500 and $1,000 per piling. And that's expensive. Look at all the pilings I have here. Yeah, yeah, okay. Okay. So this is really solving a lot of issues. If somebody went to their marine contractor and said, "I need some snap jackets," okay, on on, on my pilings. Do you know anybody that that kind of distributes your product to to any kind of marine contractor? Yeah. Well, marine contractors can buy it through the Dex and Dock stores. Located okay. And, and their website, guys, is dex-docks.com. And Mark, if, if somebody's a marine contractor or they're a homeowner and they want to get more information on what you have, how would they get snap jackets? At snapjackets.com.